Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Dyson Sphere Program. Yes, that's like what we're playing. Uh, I've been looking at the research here. I decided to uh, skip the drone engine and get it to the foundation. The foundation is going to be able to help build the floor so we can get a better factory going around. And it makes it easier for me to walk across uh, water. Uh, unfortunately, it is taking a lot of research, so I have to add another one of the research facilities. So what I want to do is I actually want to take this out. I'll take it. I did not want to take that out. Oh, it's a good thing I got others. Ha ha ha. Anyways, I want to get uh, two research facilities actually creating the, the matrix matrices. And the other, other one actually researching. So what I'm going to do is I did actually unlock the splitter. Oh, is that not going to work that way? Hmm. Alright, well, I might have to rework this in. I haven't actually used these before. Just like everything else in this game, I haven't actually done any of it. Alright, let's go to a splitter. I'm wondering if you actually need to... Okay, just match a sorter. Go here. I want to see... If I can. With four directions, it can split the passing cargo or balance the cargo on multiple conveyor belts. The splitting speed depends on the conveyor belt speed. Use the tab key to switch okay. to different styles. Yeah, you have to do it that way. Set priorities and filters. That's right, so other object. So apparently there's still a sorter there. I think maybe not. I don't know. Uh, so I think I do have to get a little bit more, a little more of a gap there. And do that. Then I can do that, yeah. Alright, that's how I gotta do it. Not a problem. Let me do that and continue on. And do that. Put that in there. Now I'm wondering about the conveyors. I actually have to make more. Uh, let me do that and I'll continue that thought. Okay, I am back. So let's see how this works. Now they were supposed to say, I think they were saying uh, using plus and minus to in, uh, increase height. Or was it up arrows? Aha, was up, up, up arrows. Actually get a bit of rotation so we can see what's going on here. Okay, not bad. It doesn't have to be that high. I guess it does if I need to be walking around it. Well, it doesn't really matter, I guess. So we'll go down and then we'll bring it down to here. Hmm. Let me figure this out. Oh, that's not what I'm doing. Come on. Ah, there we go. And we can bring you in here. Actually, what we can do, we get rid of that, and then go back to the conveyor. One can go in on one side, one can go in on the other side. Okay. And then we go from here, over here, and insert that oh I oh yeah okay it worked I did have power and I have to make another inserter of course I do actually I didn't but I did anyways because you're gonna need a million of them actually I do need another one down here or not insert sorter Okay, so you're making matrices, you're going to be making matrices, you're going to be researching. Now we get to see the, uh, the fancy blue blocks go everywhere. Alright, so yeah, these are producing at about 20 a minute. And then this is researching... don't really know, it's going by hash marks. But... Anyway, uh, of course, the power is running low, so I think it's about time we get our uh, big old power grid going. I got all that coal I'm uh, mining out, and I'm not even using it. But we gotta go over here, 
maybe it's time to actually upgrade the, the mech engine too. We can make these motors now, they're actually not that bad. I just need coils, gears, and iron ingots. Got a lot of iron on me, let's go ahead and grab a stack or yeah, stack should to do. Stack of those, and then I need to. I can make 98, and I need. What did I actually need? Upgrades. You want. Drive engine. Oh, that's not it. No, not drone engine. That's actually queued up. Yeah. Mech frame, I need 60 of them. Alright. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, that's queued up. Go ahead and queue up that upgrade. One meter second is actually not that bad. I think it's basically double the speed right now. All right, well, that's gonna do its thing. I will bring you back when that's all done. Actually, I'm back to it sooner than I thought because we were gonna get some thermal power going. Now, I was uh, looking at the the thermal generator apparently it's produces about the equivalent of seven what does that sound it must be a sound of assembler or something like that uh but yeah it produces the same about produces the same as seven wind turbines so i've got all this coal here i actually have it in this this um container here so I might as well build it here. All right, well, probably gonna need some, so I actually have to wait for the queuing. Okay, water pump, oh yeah, we don't need that. Uh, ah, that's what I'm looking for. Let's plan ahead, we'll get two going. Uh, it's gonna take some time to build this, so I'll bring you back when this is all finished. I just got a warning, research speed too slow. But I did realize I have one of these already set up, so let us just get set up right there a get. thermal power station such power facilities and need to consume chemical energy fuels if you wanted to generate continuous and stable power you need to ensure sure i'll go with that at all times. okay oh i gotta put another Another sorter on the container here. There we go. Alright, that's a lot faster on that sorter. So now we're producing a lot of power. Now hopefully the research speed is going to be able to catch up enough with these achievements. Okay, well let's uh, I'm make it all the way back here. Let's see what's going on here. I, I love these models. Uh, the, 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 the depth of field too is really nice. I did a good job on this game. Can't wait to see how it looks when we uh, build our Dyson Sphere. Uh, the star that is going around that we're actually traveling around it. Am I going to be able to see the Dyson Sphere that I build as I build it? So eventually when it comes late in the game, you watch the sun go by and it's casting no light on the planet whatsoever. Possibly. All right, well, I got another one locked up, but we're good, we're good on power right now. Let's go check the research situation. It does look like it is backlogged, so. We actually need power here. That's what's holding it up. That's one Tesla to one Tesla tower. Guess I can get rid of these. Don't really need those there. All right, as long as this stays full and keeps researching, that's all that matters. A nice little blue line, and eventually we'll have red, and then green, and then yellow, and God knows how many other cut different colors. Anyway, I am waiting on research. Uh, I can't really do much until that's done, so I'll bring you back. I gotta say, that's really cool. Being on the planet, walking around, and seeing this big giant, big gas giant just sort of hanging above there. Yeah, I love where games have come these days, huh? Anyway, I'll be back. Okay, so environment modification is done, which means I can actually start building foundations. Now, I sort of had an area for this. I built this thing, thing to the wireless power, uh, transmission tower. Apparently, 
Uh, my suit isn't actually charging off the Tesla Towers, but apparently it charges off of this, so... Anyway, uh, we will do that. Uh, so for the foundations... Uh, foundations require... Uh, they require stone bricks and steel. Uh, stone bricks, I've got stone right over here. Steel comes from iron, which is right here. So let's go ahead and get this going. So I need... Don't want to need a crazy amount, so I'm going to make two miners. Uh, we're going to, of course, uh, not make any chests because I haven't. Actually, we'll make one more just because. And then I need a whole bunch more container uh, conveyors. What am I missing? Back of what? Material. Oh, I need iron. Uh, and I got base orders and a couple of smelters. So let me grab the resources, get everything together, and I'll bring you back when that's finished. Okay, I have everything all set up, except for the fact that it's nighttime right now. And I forgot one sorter. But uh, there we go. So this is producing iron, which is going into the arc smelter, which is turning it into iron ingots, which is going into here, which is turning it into steel. And the steel is going to go all the way down here. And all across the little conveyor water bridge. And it's going to the assembler over there. And this one here is taking the stone and converting it into stone bricks, which is also going into here, which is making foundation. Now uh, the foundations, I have never... I, I can actually use them. Oh, they're a three by three tile. A terrain leveling tool. Yet we cannot use it to change the planetary landforms at will. We can only level the surface to ground zero. If the foundation is used for high grounds, it will gain soil pile. On the contrary, if it is used on the ocean or low lying areas, it must consume soil pile. When installing the foundation, either choose a kind of decoration or without decoration, even only surface leveling. Okay, I gotcha. So basically... Oh, wait, hold on, what? Yeah, let me see if we figure this out. Aha, I'm a genius. I need nine of them. So that means I get nine of them. Now, unfortunately, I have to use them to get dirt. But then, if I go and place it, it'll fill it in. Uh, that is really good. But I need dirt to fill it in, so that's going to be a bit of an issue. Well, I guess it's not really an issue. It's like that with most games, but it just basically means that I have to go and start flattening this whole area down. Let's try this again. Yeah, it gives me dirt. And I only have five foundations, so it's only going to let me do that. And that is it. Until I get more. But we are producing them, so they'll come through eventually. Anyway, uh, I did get uh, the mech suit upgrade. Uh, research is stopped, so let's uh, see what we can do next for researching. Uh, definitely flight speed would come in handy. Uh, mass construction, don't care about that. Energy limit, not too worried about that. Drive engine. Hmm. Fine, we'll just give a lot of energy. Okay. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Oh, I need good research for that, good research for that, and I think that's what all it's going to be. It's a good research. Uh, the, the cheap one, let's actually activate that. Should actually finish in just a few seconds. Then maybe we'll check the next one because it'll tell you uh, view the uh, all the resources in an entire system. Actually, that's two hundred. So maybe we'll hold off on that. All right. Well, now what is this doing? Unlock the universe exploration. Now you can click the details display button in the lower right corner of the screen to open real time distribution details of the ore veins. Oh, there. Okay, I see what it's doing. I see what it's doing. It's actually showing off in the world. I need power. 
I don't have any fuel on me, do I? I have some logs. Uh, something I did actually notice is actually four different slots you can have in here. Uh, let me go load up on some coal. We can at least fly around. Let's turn that off because that's actually annoying. And uh, there we go. All right, now let's uh, go ahead and throw all this in here. Oh, not stone. Oh, it's all stone. Ha ha ha. Uh, let's do a control click under that. There we go. Oh, that's what I wanted. That is actually a fuel chamber. I did not realize that. So at least that will keep me going for now. Alright, now... Uh, yeah, I guess we were looking at research here. Uh, won't worry about that stuff too much because that's going to be a pain. Uh, semiconductors. Probably going to need all this stuff anyways. Uh, plasma extracting. What does this do? Oh, refined oil and hydrogen. And oil extraction. We'll probably have to get into that next. Magnetic levitation technology. That's a little ways away. We won't worry about that. Uh, smelting purification. I guess we'll need that to get to the silicone and that, that graphite. And titanium smelting, what am I going to do yet? Because we still got to get into that. That's going to be a little ways on that research. So we'll, let me see what's going to be next and we'll go on from there. Okay, just looking at it now, I think the next one we're going to get into, well, we're actually doing the plasma refining now, but I think after this, I'm going to have to get into the energy matrix. That's kind of holding up the research right now. Uh, deuterium fractioning, which gets unlocked this. This is actually holding up like a few items. Uh, what do we have here? Processor. Ooh, interesting. Alright, what was that? Oh yeah, what were these semiconductors made out of? Iron and silicon. Hmm, where do I get silicon from? I have got some. Silicon veins. Hmm. There are actually silicon on this map. Let's turn that back on and see if we can see these veins. Oh yeah, there we go. On planetary view. Do I have any silicon at all? Oh, I do not. Hmm. It's a good question. How do I get silicon then? Well, let's look in the technology, see if it tells me anywhere in here. It won't be in thermal, no. What is this? No clue. I'll we'll figure that out when the time comes. Uh, hmm. It's a very good question. Uh, let me look around. I gotta figure out where I'm at here. Well, according to the research, it's still being queued, so maybe that's why it's not showing up yet. This is actually where it is, a silicone ore, and I need the silicone ore to make the silicone ingots to the smelting factory. Same with the graphite. The graphite's gonna be coal through the smelter. And then, I don't know what the, those hydrogen symbols are. That got something to do with... Uh, plasma extracting, or what? Not too sure, but it's going to be a minute till this research is done, so we'll check it out when that's finished. Okay, there we go. It is uh, available. So let's see if I actually have any silicone on the planet anywhere. Because without it, I won't be able to do much. Apparently, so let me look around and see if I can find anything. I'll bring you back if I come up with anything. Apparently he's saying it's not, but... Oh, well, I completely missed the recipe. It's actually 10 stone to one, uh, one ore in a smelting factory. Okay, well... Now you get that set up. Oh, wow. That foundation is loud. 
I gotta see what was going on there and I realized that was the grass. So I need more stone, so let me uh get some stone set up and then we'll get I'll get a uh silicone factory one. I also gotta lay down another another power plant, maybe. But I shall return. Okay, I am just about done here. Just uh getting some power set to the whole situation here. Gonna have to put a tower there and guess another tower down here. Now that should be producing everything. I was looking at the, the rates on it. Uh, these will produce, take 10 seconds. Yeah, 10 seconds to do one, but this will do one in two seconds, but it uses two ores, so it's not really efficient, but uh, I don't know how much silicone I'm actually gonna need, but it is going through, so we have that. Uh, what else were they doing? I was... I can't remember. Hang on. Ah, yes. That's what I was going to do. Uh, I was actually going to head back over to the mainland here. And we're going to drop down another thermal generator just because we're going to need the power. Everything's going on. I was messing around with the, the foundations here. And apparently you don't have to do, like, just uh, click on one spot. You can click and drag and just sort of paint the area in. But they'll use whatever you have, as I will demonstrate here. And it's using a global amount of dirt that apparently I have from, I guess, from everything I've done. And I'm out of, out of material, out of uh, foundations, yes. That's the word I'm looking for, I want to get out of there. I hate how uh, when holding shift or control or whatever, the right click doesn't want to work. Right, right click to cancel, that is. Okay, well, let's go ahead and We'll just drop another one there, and I should have another sorter. But there we go. Now the power network is doing pretty good. Makes me wonder if uh, we get that Dyson sphere going, if I'll be able to actually tap tap into that power. But with that, uh, let's uh, queue up some research and call it an episode. I think uh, does it. 360 watts isn't bad for solar, but you know, it doesn't really matter because we've got limitless coal, essentially. Uh, photon frequency technology. Okay, now this is getting into, getting into the German to me, but not really German, but yeah. Like even crystal smelting, oh my god, I have no idea where we're going to go all, all this stuff. Uh, but it's all going to start here with the energy matrix. So we're going to queue that up and call this an episode. I thank you all so much for watching. hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, we'll see you in the next one. Later. Oh, where am I? There I am.